Hey YouTubers, Redneck Brian here. Okay, this should be the very last video of my uh, HP Touch Smart. This is the computer I got approximately three months ago and did some minor repairs and it works perfectly fine now. So here it is. I know I meant to do some videos on this demonstrating some of its features, but I just never got around to it. But anyways, it hopefully is sold. I'm getting in trade for this $150 plus a 42 inch LCD TV, flat screen TV. So as far as I know, it's a flat screen. Uh, obviously LCD is flat screen, so. Anyways, here it is. And it's been on right now for about a good hour, no problems. The screen server has came up like like it should. It's went to monitor shut off mode, just came back. It's going to turn on the TV tuner card. Let's do a quick demonstration of that for you. I'm using the uh, remote. Because I don't have a mouse currently hooked up. Let's go to live TV. And it's uh, hooked straight into my uh, satellite receiver right there. Only thing that sucks about this is I just ran that line. That's just the satellite receiver coming up. Let's change the channel for you. Oh, wrong button. There we go. So anyways, the only thing that sucks, I did run a satellite line for this, but it's not a big deal. Um, I'll just either repurpose it for something else, or I'll just uh, put it up in the ceiling and leave it up there. So, this is it, and I'm going to sell this, uh, this is a Logitech keyboard with the computer. So I did say right in the ad, the keyboard comes with it. It does have the HP keyboard still, um, but I was never able to get that working, batteries or something like that. Um, also, I think it um, has to be configured. But anyways, I never really got that working, but no big deal on that. That's why I'm selling this keyboard right here with this computer. No mouse, because I never said in the ad a mouse would be going with it. But um, anyways, what I did was I had it on Kijiji for $800 for about a month. I had one byte, then I guess the person was scared off about the price. Because this is actually what this machine is worth, because they're going for about the same price on Amazon. They're actually going for a little bit more. They're going for 900 on Amazon, and that's in used condition as well. So I figured I'd put this on there for 800. Like I said, one bite, but no sale. Anyways, I had a guy contact me yesterday. He wanted to trade the TV and some cash. I said perfect, and he's coming later on today. He just asked for the machine to be run, hooked up and running, and it is. And if he wants to see the internet working, that's as simple as plugging in an ethernet cable. I just don't have it plugged in because I don't want it to do all the updates. And, yeah, I just don't want to have, have it do all the updates. So anyways, here it is. Uh, the touch screen works exactly like any old touch screen would. Uh, come on. I'm not used to the pen, but it's easier to use your finger on it, actually, than the pen. See? Slide stuff around. And this is like any old touch screen. So, let's put the pen back up there. This does have high-def audio. I, I basically put all the details about this machine in the Kijiji ad, and it's good to go. So, okay, this is the TV I got in uh, trade for the HP Touch Smart. It is a... Demtech, D-M-T-E-C-H. I uh, did some research on this and all the information I can so far find out is it's from the UK or it's one of those uh, cheapy brands which I can't even find a store that even sells this brand. So I got it and uh, I have no remote and that's an absolute pain in the butt occasionally just for volume and stuff like that because I use my uh, satellite remote anyways but I still gotta get up and do the volume and turn it off and on but this is what I got trade plus hundred and sixty dollars for the uh, HP Touch Smart so I'll talk to everyone later please keep it redneck like always and uh, sorry about that please subscribe and comment